All right, so we are here to add some more stuff into our May signature, which we have going on here. This is a, I'm going to put all these little bits aside here for a minute. So this is what we have going on right now. I have to put the book in that we did the book review. I actually haven't written it down yet. These are some of our melted straws I put in. I love these. Not only do I love the way they look, I love just... I just love just rubbing on them. They have a really cool texture. Okay, so this is what we have going on at the moment. So let's add some more. Where are we? There we are. So let's add some more to it. So we're going to come back here to the front beginning page. And one of my cousin's little girls had her uh, confirmation recently. And um, this was on her... Um, announced confirmation announcement. So I love these little gold dragonflies. So I'm going to stick them in here. This is just Elmer's. Elmer's Extreme. All right. Then we have um, this flower drawing um, that I don't think you've seen the video yet for, um, but we are, do have a tutorial for this, and I'm gonna I'm gonna actually tip this in. It's one of our prompts for this week, this month, right? Is um, tip in. So again, I'm gonna grab some of my masking tape, my decorative masking tape, which works great for tip ins. pick it up everywhere um, but one of my favorite places to find it is either Staples or Target so I'm going to put it along there not too far in because I don't want to cover up too much of the artwork now where am I going to tip it in <laughs> I want to do it right in the front I want to do it in the back I think I might want to do it like right here Then I'm going to flip this over, put another piece of tape. Don't forget about, uh, you know, as the month is going along, don't forget about doing, you know, however you're doing your journal, whether you're doing it in a, a journal like mine where you're documenting your year, whether you're just doing artwork or whether you're working in a planner, don't forget to do some write, actual writing. Um, art journaling does have the word journaling in it. <laughs> All right, so don't forget to do that part of it. Um, I also have, I was out running around, running errands, and we're getting ready for some construction around here. It's going to be a crazy month. Um, and I found this paint chip, which um, has these different shades of like turquoise colors on it, which I just thought were so pretty and kind of for me rent, represented spring and, um, you know, um, the brightness of a fresh spring sky and all of those things. Um, the colors are morning sky, tropical waterfall, and soft turquoise. And I just, I love that. So I do think that we're going to um, put this in. The question is, do I want to tip in another thing, which I could do, or do I want to just glue it in? I might want to tip it in. I hate to say that because I have a lot of tip ins now, but I could just glue it in. But I think I want to... Hmm. So I think I want to fold it at the white line dividing the different colors. And I'm lazy right now, I don't want to reach for the bone folder, so I'm going to use the handle of my scissors to crease that. Yeah, I like that. So we're going to put some glue on this part. Put 
push that down. Is that the right way? No. <laughs> Dang it. That was the wrong way. Okay, let's try that again. <coughs> Sorry if I'm coughing. Uh, my asthma is not doing really good today. <coughs> okay. So the glue is going to hold it pretty well, but just for security's sake, I'm going to take a small piece of my masking tape and I'm going to put it back here. I'm going to crease it there and push it down onto the paper and onto the paint chip. A little piece of tape here. I could throw it away, but I'm not going to. I'm gonna just stick it randomly right there. Okay, you know, I like that. This is gonna be like a month of tippins. All right, so one of the other things I did um, real early on this month was I took a bunch of surplus uh, paint and art supplies, things that I am not using, um, that I don't care for, some of which I bought in the early days of starting art and art journaling, and they were still good, but I wasn't using them. Um, and I took them down to a place in here in San Jose that's run by First Presbyterian Church on 4th Street um, called a Women's Gathering Place. And I also took toiletries to them. We we're getting ready to remodel our two bathrooms. And we had a lot of toiletries that were perfectly good that we weren't using. And um, so I took them down to them and made a large donation, which felt really great to do. And I picked up this brochure about them on my way out. Um, so one of the things I want to do is I want to add this in. Normally, I cut it apart. And do I want to do that? I think I want this bit on the back, which has their address and everything on it. Um, not only do I like to document what I've done in the month, but I like to also have it as kind of a reference so I can go back to it and go, wait, you know, a couple months from now I can say, okay, wait, I found some more stuff. What was that place that I donated to? It was this place. Or if my husband says, what was that place? Oh, it's in my journal. Hang on, let's go look. Right? And I think I want to just put it in in its entirety, like right here. So we're actually going to just put some tape runner on the back of this. Which I have to get some more of. Okay, and we're going to put that inside this tip in. Yep, that worked great. So now we can come back here and pull our pen out and I can do some journaling. So I'm gonna do that and I'll be right back. Okay, so here we go. We have our journaling done and already the journal is looking, the signature for this month is looking really great and really interesting, full of texture and color. Uh, love it, love it, love it. So keep going with your journal this month, add some tip-ins, add some texture, add some color, add some things that remind you of spring and starting fresh and have fun with it, documenting your journey and your life. I hope that you're enjoying your week and uh, if you have any questions, comments, or concerns, uh, please um, contact me. If you're in the Facebook group, uh, you can just make a post and you can pin me in it. Um, if you're not in the Facebook group, you can email me or private message me or leave a comment here on the video. If you want to be a member of the My Year 2017 Facebook group, which is what this is for, and you're not a member, why aren't you a member? <laughs> um, the links for that group, my other Facebook group, um, my Happy Mail address, the link to my Etsy shop if you want to support my channel and my endeavors with art, um, my email address, my Happy Mail address, all that stuff's in the description, so check out the description. Um, and uh, the most important thing, uh, of course, also like, share, and subscribe if you would. That would be great. But the most important thing is to go out and have a great day, everybody, and do something nice for yourself because you deserve it, and I'll see you later. 
Bye.